As parents return to the office, daycare centers are facing staffing shortages. And as WBZ's Paul Burton shows us, child care centers are being forced to make some tough decisions. The last two weeks have been rough. We are trying the best we can do um, with what is being presented to us at this time. As children sleep peacefully at the Stepping Stone Learning Center in Hingham, owner Charlotte McLaughlin is shedding some light on the anxiety she feels because of a staffing shortage. We don't have the staffing. I mean, the staffing is our hugest enemy right now. Well, McLaughlin says she's not alone. As more people get vaccinated and return back to work, many daycares are being inundated with requests for child care, but not enough workers to staff the facility safely. Pre-COVID, McLaughlin had 15 on her staff. Right now we have nine. nine, yeah, and they're overworked, they're underpaid, they're stressed to the max. Another big challenge is finding qualified, dependable applicants. Many applicants are applying and not coming to the interview. They're not calling you back. Here at the Stepping Stone Learning Center, there are actually 34 families on the waiting list. Parents calling every single day, hoping that there's a spot for their child. But McLaughlin says there's simply not enough staff to accommodate. The other thing she had to cut back on are her operating hours. Parents are stressed. I mean, we have parents that are daily asking me changes in hours. And unfortunately, that's one of the things we can't accommodate right now. And I feel terrible. But one thing she's proud of is her refusal to compromise the safety of these children whose smiles brighten her day. I need qualified, um, hardworking, reliable staff members that love their job of working with children that are going to come in um, and nurture these families like their, their own. In Hingham, I'm Paul Burton, WBZ News.